Okay, um, where am I supposed to go? Don't think that's right. I think it's cool. Uh, which frag oh, fragments do I have? Yes, I've got six out of seven graviton cores. I'm on my way to get the seventh. What was the other thing I wanted to check? <laughs> Chai, you are definitely mean. <laughs> Well, I mean, if you don't want me to stream, Chai, I can block you on Twitch. Then you'll never have to see my streams. I was going to check something else, and I've completely forgotten what. How many fragments am I on? 61, okay. The other thing I wanted to check was the number of wild artifacts I have. I think those are in key artifacts. Well, I've got two. The village of I mean, I'm only showing one viewer, so you must not be watching already, Chai. So you won't even notice how I block you. I'll hold you to that, Chai. Although, actually, given what you've been googling this afternoon, maybe I don't want you to love me too much. I was wandering through the void beyond, and I ended up there, Kubo. It was terrible in Valhalla. It was, Kubo. Kubo. But then lightning found me and took me in. So in the end, everything worked out, Kubo. I see. So that's your plan, huh? You go where the wind takes you. I never thought I'd say this, but I'm kind of jealous. Kubo? I'm a rolling stone, Kubo. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's probably a mercy. Ah, there's the three viewers. Twitch dashboard is just slow. Anyway, this is Ebba 300. Or the Dust Storm. Hello. Hello. The Time Mog Clock just did something years. really weird. Like, it, it got halfway to appearing and then vanished again. Did you exit a, a danger zone? Maybe. I think more likely I probably like went from one area to another at the right time. Yeah. <sighs> Wait, what? Oh, that must be the wild artifact gate to Erba four hundred. The rifts only the rifts only spawn in a particular order here, don't they? Because otherwise there'd be one here. In that case, which is the first of these to spawn? Dang. <laughs> that would be that one over there. 
Oh no, there are a couple of them. Whoa, hello. The tiny little flappy see they're really funny. <laughs> So full of energy. And so not full of HP. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're yeah. Just like you could breathe on them and they would fall over. I'm energy. actually pretty high leveled now. Like I'm. I'm uh... I mean, even when you're on level form, they're not. Yeah. They're not tough. They really. Uh, what is this place? It looks kind of. I don't know. When finished. Lent into uh, the the speed aspect in this game of the combat. The time labyrinth is an incomplete state, Kubel. How do you know that? Or better yet, who did you hear that from? Did your friends back home tell you about it? Hey, Mog, are you absolutely sure you don't remember anything about your past? Not a single thing, Kubel. Right. Let's match some nodes. Uh, oh, fuck's sake. Wow, you are really bad at this. Yep. I just got really stuck on that middle one because the sequence wouldn't quite line up for me. Yeah, see, the thing is, I don't try and, like, go for specific ones. I just go for whatever crystals are available. Yeah, but I had to stop because literally no pairs were available. That's literally never true. No, I mean, in the sense of, like, I wasn't going to get to one in the time available. Like, b by the time I had got to another node... It would have switched. Uh. <sighs> anyway. God, it's this one. This is the one I really suck at. Fuck off. Tears does this one have five, I guess? Fucking tonberries. Last Patreon payout. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Then I get to close the fucking Patreon and not have to worry about updating it constantly. Whoops, I ran out of time. <laughs> <laughs> yep. 
Yeah. Was really close, but I did yeah. it. We fixed another distortion in time, Koopa. Whoop. Each, bom each bomber guy is going to stream him trying to do a 100% uh, 101% playthrough of Donkey Kong 64 wow. because he put 72 hours in as a child but never actually beat the game so he's just like, fuck it, we're gonna do a stream and all the donations are going to charity <laughs> uh, It's gonna be a long stream but, Yep <laughs> What it's also going to be fucking treasure or something? Donkey Kong 64. <laughs> I smell something familiar. Yeah. I know this smell from a long, long time ago, Koopa. A long time ago? Even before you met Lightning in Valhalla? Koopa. That familiar smell. Could it be the smell of your hometown? Could we be close? Maybe the labyrinth is connected to the place where you grew up. Mm, now that I think about it, I remember the same scent coming from the other labyrinth too, Koopa. All right, then. The animation where he stops and spins the little like gem on top of his stick is too cute. Chocobo! I think the the thing that made it easier for me was that the the crystals don't cycle while you're holding a a, a tether and for a little bit afterwards. So I just grabbed the nearest one I had and ran to a pair that was visible. Hmm. That's probably how you're supposed like, to do it, actually. Because yeah, I never never really had an issue. Part of the problem is that like. I, I don't know whether it's just my eyes or something, but I struggle to tell a lot of the colours apart. Like, the white, grey and purple, uh, and black, actually, I can get any two of those confused with each other, pretty much. I think it's just your eyes, but I'm also a colour stickler, so... Speaking of eyes, I should fucking put my glasses on. Probably. I'm being irresponsible. <laughs> Yeah, I, I could mix up the the purple and the gray, especially because uh, of the floor, and the perspective could fuck with uh, the colors, but everything else was pretty clear for me. That one, I got a really smooth run on, which is nice. Yeah, having the, the tether pulled the crystals... Well, it's just everything was like every time I completed Link, it was really close to the start of another obvious Link. Um, well, yeah, that's because that's how they're supposed to be done, because you eliminate p color possibilities for each crystal that you. Match yeah, up. but like a lot of the a lot of the uh, layouts just simply don't work like that, unless you happen to get the perfect starting point, which isn't always obvious. Uh, where might there be more rifts? Uh, 
guess they're one. Huh. Cocoon is actually in a different part of the sky than it was in 13. <laughs> Hmm. Like, its direction from Erbit is just different. Interesting. It is nice to be fighting Astroprotoflorian type enemies and them just like dying in a reasonable amount of time. Yeah. Ah, that's why I couldn't see the third rift. It was behind a tree. Sneaky. Okay, they just changed while I had it while I was holding a tether. They... They shouldn't. Hi, Sarnay. Hello. No, nope. oh shit. Come on. Oh man, these change really frequently. Not even close. I won't get lost again, I promise. There we go. Oh, there's an appearance of a Centaurian. Sorry, uh, sorry you'll be so happy.
No. Okay, that's three down. I knew you had it in you, Koopa. There's one over there. What? God, these battles are happening too fast for me to even keep track of. kind of puzzle are we about to move into? Whoop. Dropping painkillers feels like a particularly cruel joke. Yeah. Take your time, Kubo. Oh, it's clocks. This one I should yeah, be able to do. <laughs> I mean, there's going to be more. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah that's... Gonna do it ever 400 after this, and like that's peak clock. Uh, but this one looks like a pretty easy one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is the kind of puzzle that people want in video games. <laughs> <laughs> it spices up the dungeon. <laughs> Fuck. Oh man, that was only two levels as well. What? There really was the puzzles people want in a fucking dungeon. <laughs> like, here's, Whoops. here's fucking 13 seconds of being distracted by something. <laughs> <laughs> Somewhere here, allegedly. Whoa, what? Oh, fish. Screenshot two. Right. Where the crap is it? Seath.
somewhere along here is another chest. Approximately. Ah, there it is. Sure, there were more enemies than that. Oh, God, there's a stupid box I've seen up in the background. <laughs> yep. I think you're supposed to get it from like. Further up. Yeah. You could definitely pitch Mog at it from down here. I couldn't get him high enough, I tried. No. Like, that probably is an angle that you could do it from, but it's much easier to not. I mean, more excuses to throw Mog. True. Take some deep breaths if you're nervous. I see how to do this one. I think it's like... That. Ah, some of these you actually need to do a movable hunt to get them to appear. I forgot about that detail. Whoops. Satisfactory. Find me a rift. <laughs> they kind of are. Yeah, that that fourteen life letter is tonight for US folks. It's at 8.30 my time, and 11.30 for most of my friends. And that's gonna be fun, because everyone's like, Oh god, are we gonna get any new ex expansion details? Because there was a fucking trademark from Square Enix that people are thinking are the, is the new expansion name. Sounds like fun. 
What? Yeah. Let's try that again. Yeah. The, uh, the title is Shadowbringers, which is a fun expansion name. Yep. Did it wrong again. Journey and here. This one in particular, I remember fucking with me. Oh, wait, you can't stand around too long, can you? Nope. Fucking. That's why I hate these. I would be fine with it if it's just like, you can stand on these as long as you want, but. The fact that it's a time limit on top of having to do the thing sucks. Mm. Here's a way to solve any paradox. We can't let our journey end here. I think you have to loop around to the left first. That's possible, isn't it? Um... So what would that look like? Because basically, the puzzle game I've been doing on Switch is basically finding paths like this, but it's not time sensitive, mm -hmm. and they make uh, pictures, so. No, it, you must have to go right first. Yeah. Because there's no way to get back into that front right corner. Oh, you want to go right and then... That's why there's so much empty space in the top right. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I see what you mean. Yeah. And Something you get the like... one in the top left last. Like the, the two crystal up there. Yeah. There we go. Oh god, they start moving around. Yeah? That's where it really gets to be the kicker. I mean, they weren't great before what with the whole the floor fall out under you. But yeah, they're a bitch. I don't Guys, like them. Smile upon me this time. There's set solutions, so like you could just look up solutions, but also having to do that sucks. Think outside the box, Cabal. No, god damn it. I'll be helping in spirit, so good luck, Cabal. Will smile upon me this time. No. There we go. Did that wrong. How do we do this?
Oops. Okay. Did just have enough time. That was a little bit tight. That's the one that it's the last one to appear. I haven't done that one further along the beach. Is it further along the beach? No, it's not further along the beach, it's up. I don't get is why on Seekers specifically Sarah's AI will only do single target moves yeah I don't know like I, I'm not set to X paradigms anymore sorry cross paradigms I mean whatever <laughs> yeah having some kind of plan right first step Proper oh clock good. puzzles. Fucking PSN is having a sale. I wonder if fucking Yakuza is on sale and I can regret not having any money. <laughs> well, Answer, uh... fucking no. Still 20 bucks, but they're having a flash sale. 1, 2, 2, 1, 3, 1, 2, 1, 1, 2, 2. Wow, Final Fantasy 15 Royal Edition is only twenty dollars. Bloodborne Complete Edition is only twelve twenty-four. <laughs> I spent fucking thirty bucks on that. Mm-hmm. Oh wow, that's a busy clock. Sky Blue is four. Okay. Yeah. Four, three, five. Okay. Disgusting. Persona 5 Ultimate Edition is 5749 even after a fucking half price cut. This bundle includes the game, the healing item set, the Japanese audio track, the new difficulty of bubble, and skill card set. And it has costumes from Catherine, Devil Summoner, Dancing All Night, Persona 2, 3, 4, 4 Ultimax. It's got the Christmas Maiden Butler, Persona 20th Anniversary logo, swimsuit Morgana car sticker for Phantom Thieves logo, regular clothes and school uniforms, Jin Megami Tensei If, 4 in Persona. Then, um... Fucking nine sets of personas. <laughs> Just good grief. Why would you need that much persona five? We did it, Kubo. We solved the paradox. On to the next labyrinth, Kubo. Oh shit, Zero Escape is only twenty bucks, the non ori games. Uh Right. There should now be two puzzles left to do. But I also need to go and get that one chest. That it's Chocobo. White Chocobo. God damn it! I wish I could get those fucking jerseys. Fucking Nisa has like 
fake jerseys for the printies as if they were the, a sports team. Oh my god, that's amazing. And the back just has, in the place of the name, it just says dude. <laughs> oh. I want it. <laughs> that is kind of amazing, actually. I love it. <sighs> I would so add that to my wardrobe. That's such a look. <sighs> Time to go see if they sell those fucking things. Because they probably do. Store. North America. Let's see. Wearables. That's probably where they'd be. That wasn't even a warm -up. Oh. What class even are white chocobos? Medic. Are they? Pretty sure. Either that or synergist. I'm like 99% sure that's one of those. Because mm. green's a medic. Maybe medics like commando, and there are two. Like the green chocobo, white chocobo, and just a medic. Uh, green chocobo has an improved cure, but white can use one of its two saved slots for improved cure to you from a level 39 exo ray. It ends up a better healer with its 1000 magic plus surge boost plus improved cure 2 versus green's 800 magic plus improved cure 1. Right. It has more defense, it also has more defense, and it has a slot free for the same critical faith ability that green has locked, or any other passive. Hmm. And it gets all the cure spells and reason, all that stuff. So yeah. That's an upsetting t-shirt I'm looking at. Oh? <laughs> Do tell. Oh, no. Please it's explain fucking... out loud on my stream. <laughs> it's in the Nisa store, and it's it says, follow your dreams. And it's a humanoid, upright standing, Blue man with a pretty face and a fanny pack over his stomach. <laughs> oh my god. And like, the thing is like, I guess they, they just have like, a line of clothing that is just riffing on the idea that you'd go to like a pretty college and it's just pretty state. And that's like the little logo. That's on the kind of shirt. amazing. Oh man. Also, the Disgaea Legacy shirt and hat are coming out this October, which I kind of want to get, because they have a really cool design. But... Money. I guess I'll have some money before war stuff comes out. If your detector's going off, then you must be right. <laughs> also, they have a $40 printy helmet, which is just wow. a plush hat that you put on your head. And it looks like a printy. <laughs> fucking, I want to buy that. You <laughs> make me a fucking printy, Kigu. Ah, <laughs> uh, God, that actually sounds too much like my brand. <laughs> There's also a pretty cool dude tote bag. This is just blue and it has pretty cool dude printed on it. That's pretty cool. Oh, pretty. Yep. I don't know if it's fifteen dollars cool, but two, three, one, one, three, one, three, two, three, one, one, three, one, three. Solve.
that's a four. Four, three, one, two, two, three, three, one, one. Four, three, one, two, two, three, three, one, one. And solve. I was just reminded of the fucking Sonic character. <laughs> I guess it's PAX weekend. Yep. I guess that's happening. Can't wait to find out the games are still trash. There's a gate that I want to open. After I've gone and got that cussed chest and also solved this anomaly as well. I continually feel that like Chon Chon should be the name for the arms and Seeker should be the name for the bats. I don't know why. Yeah. Well, I mean, I know why, because bats are things that can fly and can seek things. And the other things are just like knockoff Geo dudes. <laughs> That's one way of putting it, I suppose. Ah, there it is. Oh, God. It's another white chocobo. Always take a crack at uh, recruiting one. Even though, like, Choco Squad is not uh, likely to have a medic in. Yeah. I mean, that's a good medic. Hmm. Wait, where did the fucking chain go, bastard? It negated it with its move. Is that going to be enough to knock it off? I guess it kind of was. Uh, not going to get a drop though, unfortunate. Nope. Is that close enough? Probably not. Oh, it was. Nice. It's good that Mog has fucking telekinesis. <laughs> I mean, he could literally just hover over to it. It was like four feet away. Yeah, yeah but he didn't. <laughs> he just kind of like, yes, I'm opening this. But I guess that's how everyone opens everything. It's just like, move their hand in that direction. Because chests are weird future chests. Yeah. Oh. 
This one might be crystal bonds again. Yep. Place. It smells like tears, Cabal. Really? I can't smell anything. Is this place filled with sad memories? I remember <laughs> crying here a long time ago. Mug. I was all alone. <laughs> It yeah. smells it like tears. Fucking okay. Big Abba moods. So that's Sarah's and Noel's weapons. What else are we gonna have? No, god damn it. Too many nodes, I can't. The fact that there's two different kinds of purple is also bad. Yes. One is more indigo and one is more like lavender ish, but it's still just like. Ugh. Yep. And a blue the heat as of well. Puzzle solving. Yeah, the heat of the puzzle solving, you can't always pay attention. Yep. And sometimes the light can be such that the two different colors look. Like the two matching colors look different. Because they're crystals and they catch yeah. the light differently. Which is cool, but also a giant pain in the ass. Yep. It would help if the camera moved quicker as well. Oh, this is going to be tight. Don't change on me like that, you shit brick. I'm not going to do it. That's going to be so tight. Uh, I got it. I do like the kind of constellations idea that goes on here. It kind of makes up the resemblance between the um, the crystal pattern and the monster. Okay, that time it worked. I mean, to be a speedrunner, to be good enough at these that you always end up, like, on the side near the exit as well. Yeah. This is the sort of thing you only get through extreme repetition, which is yeah. not, not going to be doable for most people. Not yep. even going to happen for most people. We'll play this once. I'm glad it seems like they got the internet connection sorted out for Monster Hunter. Maybe I can actually play with friends now. Hmm. Hopefully. Now I just need to fucking convince friends to be playing when I am. <sighs> well, soon we will have streams, although that won't be on PC. Yeah. And 
gonna talk to Adrian about uh, doing the final bumper, and that'll be good. Mm-hmm. I presume they need to do some crystalline. This crystalline tier is really complicated. But yeah, actually, what time next week do you think you wanna we wanna start the uh, monster hunter? That is a good point. We are supposed to be starting that next week, aren't we? I don't know. Um, well, I mean, we're not so, so much supposed to be starting it next week as next week's the first week we feasibly could start it. Yeah. <laughs> um, hmm. I'll have a think about it. Uh, yeah. No hurries, because like, I am going to need to cram some editing to make that work. Um, yeah. That's, is that three sub? Yeah, three sub. All the remaining big nodes are sub. Six. I'm supposed to go into 93. One, two, three. And the rest of these should be set. Also, because of how all the stuff shakes out, and how I'm probably gonna be... It's probably gonna just be better if I come in on my, uh, on my main file to help out with stuff. And I'll just, like, <laughs> limit what kind of weaponry I use so I don't overpower everything. But, yeah, that'll be... That'll be fun. What am I looking for? Uh, right. Three sin. And that should go to fifty seven eventually. Let's do Rattenvale. That sounds good. Sin. Actually. Wait. One, two, three, four. These should all I'm be ready. Rough. Yeah, I should be doing upsurges, but none of the locales are in upsurge right now. That's 57 sin. I want Rav. Needs to go to 61. Oh, and sin. Diesel is harassing Artabon right now. Ooh. Temporary Artabon tracks. Nice. Cool. <clears throat> Let's go to the prettiest location in the game. Which one is that? Air Before 400. Ah. Paralyze me, you fucking guys of luck, huh? <laughs> fucking explosives. Piece of shit.
Oh shit, it's Basil! Oh, he wants me. Oh, he doesn't. Okay. I'm fine with that. Bye. No, 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 don't look at me funny. I forgot to eat. Mom, have you been able to remember anything about your hometown? Anything at all? Kupo! I remember something called the Ocean of Time, Kupo. Hmm. The Ocean of Time. Could that be where you're from? I don't know, Kupo. But I do know that when I think about that place, I become all flustered and giddy, Kupo. So that place means something to you. Then it must be important. I think we should check the Airbo Labyrinth some more. more. Maybe we can help Mark remember more about where he came from. Kupo? You'll help me find my home and my family, Kubo? Yeah. Mark just, like, drifted out of his own close-up there. At least owe you this much. In engine cutscenes. They're magical. Yep. Get ready for some hardcore puzzle solving. These might be the last uh, rift puzzles in the game, actually. I don't have really many more hard, to do. You'll solve it in no time, Kubo. Yeah, I don't recall. Oh god, I just found some tempered basil fucking tracks. Don't give me investigation, please. No. Threat level two. Those are scary. No, go away. I love it when Sarah just clips into something that's visibly not there. Where's that other one going? Ah, right. This fucking one also fucked with me. I remember it well enough that I can tell you that much. Yeah. <laughs> this one's a jerk. Did it though? Yay! Yep. More seekers, chonchons, things. Surprise, Behemoth! Let's see how this goes. Oh! Yep, that's a big boy. Man, they stand up early. 
I mean, they do that as, like, a health threshold. Yeah. I mean, just that, that's a high, th high health threshold, is what I mean. And it was like 65%. That's high. I mean, I mean they, they aren't nearly as... Like yeah, you also shredded the motherfucker. Yeah, they aren't nearly as threatening as the uh, FS-13 ones. Um... And you're also overleveled for this area. <laughs> Moderately. You're over leveled and overpowered because you know how to play the game after practicing yeah. through 13 and 13 multiple times now. Yeah. <laughs> Beetle, stop screaming! He was just sitting above a bunch of little wing drakes and screaming at them and dropping explosives and good grief. No, don't look at me. No. Stunned him with a flash fly. Keep the fucking footprints, I'm out of here. Yeah, Cocoon should be roughly in the direction of the um, broken railway bridge, because it's behind you as you fight Bart, but mm. it's very visibly off to the left. Interesting. Okay, this looks easy, says Sarah. No, it doesn't. It must be... Understand this one. You have to get the. You have to hang a left. Mm. No. I don't understand how you get the one in the center of the kind of bottom right quadrant. Um. You go. You loop around the the left bottom like loop. Then hit uh, that one that's just sitting there. Then go down, get the one that flashes in, and then yeah. go up the right path. <laughs> if nothing else, being online and watching people stream puzzle games yeah. over the last seven <laughs> years has taught me to use my words very carefully. <laughs> oh god, this one's huge. <laughs> And flashing. Yep. You have to get these when they're in that configuration, not this configuration. Yes. Oh, 
flashback. Thank you. Tremulous Muffin. I'm sorry? That's the name of the fragment. That's... Very bad. What? <laughs> I, I'm just saying what I see. I know, but that's fucking... Game, what the fuck is your problem? This muffin was so bad, it was a paradox. I mean, we are, like, these rifts are somehow Mog's backstory, so... I don't know if that makes more or less sense. <laughs> For fucking a muffin, why? Uh, fragments, locations, Airbus 400F, Tremulous Muffin. Paul Mark had never met anyone of his own kind. One day a group of quivering flan were whisked into the void beyond. Look at him, he's all round and white. He can join us, then we'll be six. Welcome to the mini flan musketeers, all for one and one for all. And so, just like that, Monk was a flan. One of the flans said, we flew here from the forest of Sunlith, come fly back with us. But you didn't fly here, you just carried him to the void beyond, objected Mark. Befuddled, the flan looked at each other, and then suddenly all five of them were sucked into another gate. What? That <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, that, 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 I guess, is just what? Mog being a tremulous muffin. What the fuck? <laughs> Things do get a bit weird in the deep lore of this game. <laughs> Fucking... But you didn't do the thing you said you did. Oh. Warp paradoxed. Mm-hmm. Fucking whatever. This game is stupid. And I love it. <sighs> no comment. Don't curse Gammy. Fuck face. <laughs> what have you found, Mog? Find me the thing. Slow and steady should do it. More crystal bonds. This is not going well.
two yellows as well. Yeah, the fact that they have to, like, differentiate them by color makes the, the complexity unexcusable. Inexcusable. Because, like, that means they have to come up with new bad differentiating shades. I mean, it would be fine if the crystal textures were less aggressively uh, shimmery. Honestly? It would have been easier to read them if they were just like fake 3D and they were just like 2D sprites that rotated. Yep. But we couldn't have that on a next gen console. No. Oh, fuck's sake. Sarah! <laughs> Sometimes she just stops walking. It's like, we're on a timer here. Forgot how quick the acid in this place drains your health. Thanks. Uh, no. Fuck's sake. No. Gonna fail the puzzle. Ah! Oh, I needed like one more step. Sarah was literally on the right platform. Yep. For that, I can cross that off the list. Rare fruit. Right. Okay. <clears throat> oh man, this one has more than five stages. Yep. Yikes. Time to go see if I got the right veggie for delivering the thing I thought I did. Custom platter. Veggies. New four five. Yep. Oh, the fuck? Did I already? What? Oh, right. Guests. So mechanic is that you have to build up your canteens, uh, like stocks of access to ingredients. But if anyone else in your online lobby has access to it, you can use their their stock. So, like, I have a bunch of ingredients I don't normally have. Which is a nice benefit to playing online with people. But... Yeah. 
it makes seeing and making sure that you have all the items yourself kind of annoying. Because you're just like, did I get that? No, it's got a little stupid icon I didn't notice. Oh, fuck the cat. Forked cats are cute. Like the entire family is just like, why are you in a jar? Okay. <laughs> Somehow, in all of that single targeting this forked cat, everything else in the encounter just casually died. I mean, you did pop a ruin go. True. Right, I've done one, two, three. There should be one. Yes, straight ahead of me. Toby Kadachi Claws. Always. The fucking Toby Claws. Okay, fucking. I was gonna do. Okay, what's gonna be this time? Okay, this looks easy. More. Bonds. Although these look like they might be simpler. They're certainly starting simpler. <sighs> okay, I was definitely supposed to do this group first. <laughs> yeah. Nah, that's surprising. shouldn't be yawning. I slept properly and had a bunch of coffee. <laughs> Sometimes it just happens. I've been yawning all day. Yeah. Possibly because of the thought of having to get up in time to be on campus at 9 on Tuesday all of a sudden. I have a meeting Oof. I have to go to that I was hoping to be able to bring it out of. Yeah. 
I think it's just like my body readjusting to the fact that I don't have to get up at like fucking 7 a.m. because it's been insisting that I get up that early for a while. Hmm. And I got up at like 10 and I was like, wow, I slept great, and now I'm yawning, so what the fuck do I know? <laughs> That's just catching up on sleep, right? <laughs> you say that, but I've been sleeping that well since so basically fucking 2014. <laughs> I'm not not in need of sleep catching up. Yeah, I mean, like when you have a a, a lion. Was it too easy for you, Kubo? After a wild early start, so I always find it makes me kind of dopey. Uh, I'm always dopey. Shit, that should be everything on the upper tier. Oh no, set me off now. Sorry. Yeah, it happens. At least it's the evening for me. Yeah, you have an excuse. I'm just, like, tired at 1.38pm like a fucking lazy bastard. Ugh. I'm also gonna need to sit down and actually commit to the fucking 13 cutscenes viewing mm -hmm. tonight. Which is gonna be fine, but also a, a drain because I want it. I'll 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 be wanting to play it at <laughs> the time. Which is, yep. uh... Oh man. Fucking Seath spawning while I'm. while Mog is away searching a chest. Bastards. Yeah. that again, shall we? Bombs! I don't know what it is about these guys. They are like the, the absolute toughest bombs in, the, in any of the games in terms of just the amount of damage they absorb. I like the uh, the bombs in 13 because they start out at half health and they heal by doing damage to you, which is really weird. But it's a really cool mechanic. Could, yeah, but it also meant that like, if you could preempt them, they were only at half health, so you could usually yep. take them out with one spray of bullets, which is cool. Don't come back, Aragon! Fuck off! I mean, that's basically the, the way you have to deal with them. Yeah. Because otherwise they just blow up. And we and saw plenty of instances of them blowing up and wiping me out. Yeah, 
And I think they do damage based on how much HP they have when they blow yeah. up. Yeah. So, like... That can be an issue. It could be a lot of damage, that's for sure. Whoops. There we go. Fuck off. Oh my god. Some of these silhouettes are getting really hard to recognise. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck's that? Well, as a wyvern. Yeah. And that's an Enki or an Enlil. Don't change. Thank you. It's a forest beastie. Yep. Oh, come on. Oh, I jumped down before I cut that off. Oh. That's a brave cat. Does the Palico level up as well? Or does it just get better equipment and stuff? Palico levels up. Selfish pancake! <laughs> what the fuck? Let's see Mom. what the selfish pancake is. Mark had no idea if he was a monster or an Eidolon or just a simple animal. One thing he knew for sure, he wasn't a stuffed toy. After all, he told himself, how many stuffed toys can fly? One day, Mog got s sucked into a weird and scary corner of the void beyond where he met a giant monster called Adam. Are you a falsy? asked Adam. Are Moogles my brethren? No, Moogles are Moogles, Mog replied proudly. Then Adam said, I have no use for stuffed toys, and disappeared before Mog had a chance to reply. Watch your manners, Kupo, shouted Mog after him, but Adam was gone, never to be seen again. The fuck? I don't know. But also, yeah, Palico can level up, um, but they also have gadgets they get more proficient with. So, Sarnai is probably running Plunderblade from the sounds of it. Which can do damage and break off bits of monster and steal them. Including gems, which are rare drops. Like 3% to 5% rare drops. Dang, nice. Slow and steady should do it.
Easy Cockrift. But from now on, it's gonna be... Solver time. And this is 33213 Solve. Alright, these are the puzzles where it just randomly alternates between Ones that have a time limit and ones that don't. Yep. And the ones that have a time limit are random, and the ones that don't have a time limit aren't. Which is definitely the cruel way round to do it. Yeah, that's fucked. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, but hopefully we won't have to see that principle in action at all. Four, yeah. two, four, I one... I have three gold wyvarian prints and I don't know that I need anything with them right now. I could definitely use them to get like a basil gem or a nergi gem for for an easy weapon that I need to make anyway. Whoops. One five five two one. No. Five five two one. Four one five five two five. Four one five five two five. One five five two one. Four one five five two five. Salt. Oh no. <sighs> Holy shit. That's a full 13. Yep. I think that's two at the top, yes. Two, six, five, three, five. Three, five. No, that's 12. I'm wrong. One, it doesn't get more than two. Twelve, I don't think. Yeah, it's an even number. Two, six, five, three, five, three, five, one, five, three, one, five. Solve. This is where it starts getting hard to read the diagram. Yep. God bless so God, that's not even the last one. Fucking hell. This one's presumably a 13. Yep. Two, four, I can five, see five, five, just three. from the very bottom because yeah. there's a, a split. Yeah, no, that's... Too many. <laughs> one, two, Too five, fucking five, five, many. Five. Two four five five three one three five 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 one three four. Uh, this 
one. This one. Aha! Uh -huh. So this is the ocean of time. Mog, does any of this look familiar? Kubo, I remember everything now. We're headed to the place where I was born, Kubo. When Mog was still a young Moogle, he was playing hide and seek with his friends. Somehow he ended up getting swallowed by a paradox. Before he knew it, Mog was drifting farther and farther away from the land where he grew up. When he came to, he was in the void beyond, not knowing how or why he ended up there. On top of that, he had forgotten about his home, his friends, and his family. He was all alone, with no memories of his past. Your friends and family are waiting on the other side, aren't they? day would come when we would have to say goodbye to a dear friend. Someone we can't imagine our lives without. Mog, do you want to continue on this journey with us? Or do you want to go home to where your friends and family are waiting? Mog, the decision is yours. I mean, it'd be really embarrassing if Mog did decide to go home to his friends and family, because that, that's Sarah's only weapon. <laughs> That turns into other weapons depending on what she equips. Question yep. mark. So you're sure about this, Mog? You don't know if you're going they to don't really quantify trip. that. Yeah. You sure you don't want to think about this just a little bit longer? I mean, whatever she weapons she's wielding, she can't use them without Mog present. Yeah, but like they don't. Like it's not a key, a Kingdom Hearts keychain thing. Mm -hmm. That they go into point of explaining. So pick a side, Mog. Sarah or Lightning. Anyway, so. <laughs> Whoop! What's that? That's another segment. I do kind of wonder what the voice actor for Mog must have made of the lines. Right, we are now out on the beach. Is this the graviton core? That's all seven graviton cores. Now we can find out whether I'm allowed to have the super weapon this early in the game. You're not very early in the game. I mean... It's only like 15 hours in, 17 hours in, to the save file. Yeah, this game isn't that long, Becky. True. But like, I haven't, I haven't done any of the, um, like, kind of death and rebirth part of the story arc. Right? I haven't, I haven't done the, the actual Void Beyond section. Yeah, that's still pretty close to the end game. Because it's basically that and then gathering power to go to 500 AF. Mm. But, like, normally you'd have, when the ultimate weapons would unlock in that stage. Not that I played. Like, like the, the fragment powered ones 
if you're talking about those, yeah, those, those unlock basically as soon as you sort out the graviton cores. Hmm. Unless I'm misremembering. But, yeah, I, I, th I think you are right that they do, but I think it is weird that they do because in normally I would expect them to unlock, not unlock until after you've done the kind of big end of Act Two transitional stuff that we haven't got to yet. I mean. Because they grow with the number of fragments you get, they're not really going to be super overpowered until you've done all that anyway. I mean, you can get something like... Is this... Yes, it is. You can get something like 110 fragments at this stage of the game. And if you go through that, they wanted to make sure that you were rewarded for it. It's fine. Like, it's, it's uncommon, but it's not, like, completely out of the ordinary. Take some deep breaths if you're nervous. More clocks. Right, three, one, one, five. I really wish the Legiana weapons had a use because, like, I really like all their designs. But they don't seem to fucking... Like nothing is really. Plus, there's the Daura stuff that has it has to compete against for weapons. Ugh. Also, like the Great Sword doesn't have a cool Legiana design. Sword and Shield does, and the uh, Long Sword does, but. Clarks. One five one two two two. Oh right, this week has chew the fat. I'm gonna go beat the shit out of some Jaggers. Four three three one two. Four three three one four. One five one two two two. Four three three one four. I need a bunch of great Jagger shit. So, time to go kill a bunch of great Jaggers. Cheat the fat. Yes. Actually, let's see what other weapons I can fuck around with. Uh. Fuck around with the Switch X. I haven't played with that since the fucking start of PS4. That's a six. One, four, six. One, six, six, six. Four. One, two, four, three, one, four, six, one, six, 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 four. God, doing this with only a pen and paper for my solver was uh, a long afternoon. Holy shit, that was about a, an 8 second Jagger's kill. Nice. I, knew you could do it if you tried. I didn't even get a full sword combo off. <laughs> it is low rank, so whatever, but also that felt really good. I don't want to fight any bombs. Bombs go away. 
Oh shit, they're coming for me. No, <laughs> I was saved by the rambunctious chocobo. <laughs> Freaking body them. Nice. God, this area is so pretty. Just look at it. I still need to fucking find what the fucking common thread in I I feel like it's only Japanese games that do it, but like the the endless expanse of like ankle deep water okay, as a reflective surface that people stand in in anime shots. Hmm. Cuz it's in like fucking a zillion things. Yeah, and I mean there, there is a an actual place that that's inspired by. In... Well, yeah, uh, but it like, is. it's it's just really weirdly consistent. Three, three, two, three, four, two, one, two. Solve. Yep. I didn't even make it through my sword charging combo. God. HR weapons are too good. I need all these items. Give me. Three one one four three one 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 one. I'm gonna learn switch switch axe and gun lance, and I'm just gonna learn all the fucking weapons because fuck it. I'm gonna end up playing this game too much anyway. It might well, might as well get good with all the weapon types and be less boring. Also, I'm training my cat to use a Mialatov cocktail right now. Video games. Video games. Okay. Safari. Right, somewhere out here ought to be two chests. There's one. And there's the other. What's that? Okay, that should be everything for this area. Do I have 100% exploration? Yes, good. Is that Sarah's strength weapon? Yes. Oh, that is amazing, Sarah, and I, I didn't know that. <laughs> That's really good.
Hi, Colleen. Hello. Yo. I just got home from work. <sighs> Was it bearable? Uh... Yeah. Uh, well, I've still got one wild artifact. But I could only unlock one or other part of the Vile Peaks, so I couldn't do the che the quest there. Um, Have you gotten the wild artifact out of uh, the casino? No, I could go and get that, I suppose. But... Eh, it's not really worth it. Yeah. Oh, right, I should do the Wiggler quest. Wiggles! I wonder if they I wonder if they've ever made the Wiggler hat a layered armor piece. I mean they did it with the shadow shades. It wouldn't surprise me if they did the wigglers too. Let's see if we can turn in any maps. I can definitely turn in Erba. Yeah. No, I know I can turn in some maps. It's a question of how many. At least I can this time actually park myself by the map lady. Yeah. Um, okay, change equipment. I need to put Gilly Mantle in my layout. And we're just going to go hunt Wigglers so I don't need to eat. I really want to get Generations Ultimate just because, like, you can play as a cat, and that seems like a lot of fun. Just... <laughs> I am the Pelico. <laughs> uh... Caption it. Two wigglers. Oh, come on. Okay. I love this level that requires you to retraverse it to jump up down ramps. God fuck. At least once you fucking sort everything out in your 300% sure that you sorted everything out you can just park yourself by the, the the map lady and never fucking leave that corner yeah I forgot this fucking bridge is a dead end right. that's a lot of nilapsy Retracing these steps is uh, relatively good XP. Yep. Oh my god, one with that? Really? Fucking goddammit. Honestly, it, it's amazing that just by, like, the whole, do you want to go to back to camp or HQ dilemma in Monster Hunter World was mainly an issue of load times, 
And the load times are so non-existent in the PC version, it doesn't matter anymore. Because, like, if you go back to camp, you don't have to reload the fucking the zone again, because it's just, like, you pop back to camp and then pop back into the quest. It's just, like, set in a few different variables. But if you go back to HQ, it's just, like, do you want, like, a minute and a half of loading each in total? Because, yeah, goddamn, that's what you're getting. Oh, my fucking god, video game. Did you just get, like, fucking 12 tears of remorse? Uh, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> it's possible. I felt like I saw double digits. <laughs> I don't think I can have done, because they don't drop don't that many. The swearing was for the fact that, it, like, it was... Instant second encounter. Pretty yeah. much, yeah. Instant nth encounter. <sighs> Wiggler head! Fucking, I need three Wiggler tickets to make it? That's bullshit. Wiggler! Wiggler, Wiggler, Wiggler! God, I love that hat. It's so good. It's weird to me how quickly I've picked up, like, how to navigate this space this time around. I got so fucking lost in these alleys. First, yeah. time, first couple of times I played the game. This is the Yashas Masid. Reference material from Airbus? I sure hope we can. I like that all the jiggle physics in this game are on the fucking armor. And, like, by that I mean, like, little dangly butts on the armor and the wiggler head. And your weapon slapped on your back, but not properly enough to stop it wiggling. <laughs> Wiggler head is very good. Um, is that the like long neck thing? Yep. That is very good. Right, I guess. Really, the only thing to do at this point is. Go to academia and hand in some graviton cores. And then I might call the stream actually, because I do have like an abstract that I need to finish writing tonight. And a blog post to publish, shit. <laughs> That yeah, was probably was supposed idea. to happen. Yeah, it's only like 2 p.m. for a lot of folks. Yeah. So, no worries. I probably already made this joke like a long time ago, but uh, when you put on the wiggler head and use the dual blades, you go into long, long demon stance. <laughs> God. Nice. And you You're can not and wrong. <laughs> and, to and to increase your damage, you can take your long, long demon drug. God. <laughs> you're I'm glad you're in such fine drug. form today, Colleen. Okay. I want to capture more than one of these little fuckers at once. Gotta line up the shot. Take the shot! Okay. Basically, the gimmick with the Wigglers is that they stick out of holes in the ground, and if you crouch near them, they won't get intimidated and run away. Right. But also, I'm wearing a ghillie mantle, so they're not scared of me like they should be. <laughs> that helps. And I have a capture net, and that's the quest. the longest possible route through Academia 4XX though, having got all my yep. navigation in 400 perfectly correct. Yep. Seems like it. But also you're probably in a weird spot to begin with because mm. as much as it's nice to just be able to warp out at any point like you can with the pause menu, mm. uh, Sometimes you forget that you want to go specific places when you come back, and you're just like, oh, fucking now I gotta walk back anyway. <laughs> yep. 
Oh, that's Captain Cryptic. Let's not start doing Captain Cryptic nonsense. Yeah. I have to do it eventually because all fragments, but also bloody hell. Right, Alyssa, take these graviton cores. You brought us another cluster? Wow, this must have been. Oh, thanks to you two. Oops. Alyssa and I decided to come to the future to observe the. That thing. Yes. Instead, we plan to build an entire Okay, that'll get me at least one ticket, and that's all I need to finish the Wiggler hat. The academy has been making progress on the development of paradox, paradox weapons. A very powerful weapon that beat using a paradox again. Exactly. There's a possibility we may come up against the man who appears in the Oracle Drive recordings. The war has already begun, and we're fighting a battle to the end. But director, did a chaos crystal? It's a solidified chunk of. Well, hey. You... And we've got the Historia Crux. I knew I could count on you. Once you've found the crystal, I can build you a perk. You brought us another cluster? I forget how... Yeah, the Chaos yeah. Crystal is the limiting, the limiting factor. Mm. Chaos Crystal, because there's one in the uh, Serendipity that you have to buy with 10,000 uh, chips. So yep. And uh, but this was just the beginning. It would take a century to complete. I thought you got the other one when you got all the graviton cores. It might. You might. Finished. Well, I know we can do it. Chaos crystal. He's right, you know. Have you seen that broken gate in the town? Well, it's all fixed and working normally. We collected the ore crystals, so the future has changed, Kubo. Yes, I think so. And look what I found. It was lying next to the gate. <laughs> An hey. artifact. I wonder which era this unlocks. Hmm. Maybe it takes us to the day that cocoon collapses. The one we saw in the prophecy. The one where Caius is fighting. <laughs> Time for the final showdown? Let's all fight together. We'll follow you to the future by a different path. There are things there I have to protect. Right. You mean Vanille and Fang, and the new cocoon. <laughs> right. Where did your travels... We ended up at a casino. Hmm. There's an ancient... So it's a paradise. Right. But we won't be... No, no more options to turn in things. Right. So it can't be that, then. Um, I think you need to talk to the receptionist outside. Oh, well, maybe. I was looking at game FAQs because I remember there's so, some stuff that tripped me up. Let me just see what the guide says. Uh... Oh no, you do actually have to get the Chaos Crystal. Mm. And it's at Serendipity. And then yeah. you can buy the other weapon from Serendipity. Yeah. I get it. Never mind. All good here. Let's go get the gate open. It won't be long now. Hope and his team are close to raising the new cocoon. The thing about those weapons is they really quickly outpace everything else even like by the time you get them yep no matter like how early because it's just like you're gonna be getting more uh fragments anyway but also they're just good was just an imposter i wonder why the real one didn't intervene i hope he lets us finish here maybe he will if that's what it'll take to protect you and i know he will i remember we argued about that very thing once and Did we argue? I, I don't remember. Are your memories playing tricks on you again? 
No, something must have happened between you two. I... Damn it. I wish I could remember. Oh man, it's possible to obtain 122 fragments before you go to the void beyond here. That's a lot. Yeah. I think I'm at about 82, 83. Yeah. I think it's a lot. It, you can definitely do that because it, that would include the Arkelt Step stuff. Mm. Because there's no like hard limit on how much you can develop like you could... Like they could put on you in thirteen. Mm. I mean, the biggest obstacle, apart from doing the, um, apart from doing Longley and, and Yomi, is getting the gill for all the casino stuff. But if you can level up your silver chocobo, you can just do chocobo races forever. Or get lucky on slots. Yeah, which like, no. <laughs> I mean, like there is a state that it goes into where you will eventually win. A lot of coins, or a lot of chips, but finding that is a pain. Yeah, in order to get the um, the fragment from slots, I am definitely going to be sellotaping controller buttons in place. Mm -hmm. It's going to be the only fragment that we don't do on stream. Or it could be in its own stream. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, it does look like the gate's fixed. Who the fuck is calling me? Go away. Reckoning. Before we jump through this gate, we better make sure we're good and ready to fight. I wonder what Caius is up to. Where is he? Well, we still don't know if he really is against us or not. The silence makes me nervous. He's always been deadly quiet before taking action. It's like the calm before the storm. If he is in Valhalla, then he's been watching everything we've done here. And if he sees a weakness, he'll exploit it without mercy. We let our guard down, we die. So we better not use the gate until we are definitely sure. <laughs> exactly. Oh, actually, I'm not going to activate the gate just yet. Because uh, I'm not going to be streaming over the weekend, but I might want to do some grinding. Okay. Yeah. Because um, I can now go and grind in the first section of 400 again, because I've got the gate seal. Um, and that would help me boost a bunch of monsters. So I think that'll do it for tonight. Thank you for the company. And more streaming on Monday. Yep. Good night. Th